I was clear that I will only run if and when Mayor Sarah does run for president too. So since she did not, no, it was um, it was an easy decision not to run. No? Um, I have to stick to my word. Although you know, nga, no, I I found out um, just recently that the RP has uh, apparently um, um, fire asked someone to file though by way of substitution and yes. giving me the opportunity to uh, run on or before November fifteen. Yes. But I will reiterate my position uh, since the mayor Sarah is not running. No. Um, I find it difficult to, um, to change my decision as well. Although I will uh, reveal for the first time that on the last day of filing, Mayor Sarah called me and she in fact said that I should, be, I should run. She was persuading me to run. And I told her, ang hirap naman na tumakbo na hindi, hindi ko talaga um, alam kung sino man lang yung ulo. No? How much more an ulo na I do not believe in. No? Kaya, although she was persuading me na talagang go ahead and run, I, I said I will not. Although meron pa kaming unfinished business ni Mayor Sara because I did say na we have to sit down and talk about what to do with her followers. No? And uh, we've not had this opportunity to, um, to discuss because um, right after the last day of filing, she developed COVID together yeah. with the uh, members of her family. Yeah. So on that Monday that we went to... Um, to Davao for talk to the people, I intended really to visit her and talk to her, no? Kasi I really want to discuss the possibility of party building para ma-absorb yung mga supporters nila na feeling paano na ngayon sila, no? Since uh, Mayor Sarah did not run. But I still feel strongly na um, I will need to have that conversation with her to discuss how to um, deal with the supporters who until now, no? Are still hoping that she will run.